Okay, question 22. So we've got another um, another coordinate grid with a shape, and we're asked to enlarge the shaded shape by a scale factor of minus a half with a center, minus one, minus two. So let's mark that center, minus one, minus two, which is here. And it needs to be minus a half. Okay, so let, um, when we're enlarging, normally I would count. So I would count from here to say this vertex. That would be one, two, two to the right and one two three four up two to the right and four up but because it's a negative scale factor that means i'm going to go um to the left and then down so instead of going right and up i'm going to go backwards i'm going to go left and down and it's a scale factor of a half so all the distances should be a half so instead of going two to the right i'm going to go one to the left and instead of going four up i will go two down so that vertex appears here okay let's do a similar thing with this vertex here i'm going to mark it in red so i would go two to the right and one two three four five six up so that means i'll go one to the left and then three down one two three down it's already starting to take shape here um what about this guy here? So one, two, three, four, five, six to the right, one, two, three, four, six to the right, four up. So that means three to the left, one, two, three to the left, and two down, one, two. And then finally, um, this one up here, I'm going one, two, three, four, five, six to the right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's going to be um, three to the left, one, two, three, and four up, or four down, one, two, three, four. And then we can draw our shape. And a nice, that's a nice easy way to do a negative scale factor enlargement. Um, word of advice here, when you've done the enlargement, check your answer. Um, by drawing in some ray lines. So what you should do is draw lines of corresponding vertices. They should all cross at the center, if you've done it correctly. Drawing in the ray lines. This is all looking nice. So corresponding vertices. And then they all cross at the center of the enlargement. And you can see there, job is done. So that's for three marks.